my little Jolene is getting sleepy. I think it's time to lay this little babe down for a nap. It's a rainy day out, you guys. Oh, let's lay you down. It's a rainy day out today, you guys. So I'm gonna lay this little sweetie down for a little nap and we are gonna get started making some delicious food. I have a roast I wanna put in the crock pot and then I also have a banana cake I wanna make and then I also wanna make some homemade potato soup um, and baby Niaz wants to make some cookies. So I think we're gonna do homemade sugar cookies and yeah, I figured I would take you guys along with us today. Right now it's rainy and crappy. So it's like a perfect day to do all the things. And my little Jolene is getting sleepy. So this is a perfect time to start. I got the puppies up here with me so I can keep an eye on them. They're with their mother right now. So yeah, it's gonna be a good day today. Sometimes I just feel like a rainy day is just good for your mental health. Do some things that you actually enjoy doing instead of just mindless running around. I don't know, I enjoy cooking and everything like that and spending time with my little family. So for me, this is heaven on earth. But yeah, all right, let's get to it. All right, I got Jolene's boppy here. I'm going to lay her down on it. And I got my house coat to cover her with. So then she can have her mommy right by her. She likes to snuggle with my house coat. I notice sometimes more than her actual blanket. Probably because it smells like mama. Oh, God bless you. Bless you. It's so funny. She really won't ever take binkies. Like, watch. She's going to spit it out. <laughs> she keeps it in her mouth for like two seconds and then spits it out. Okay, and then we got my young man here. Say hi, Niaz. Oh, muscle man. What are we going to do? Are we going to make yummies? No, no cookies. Yeah, we're going to make cookies? Yeah. All right, let's get to work. Say bye. Bye, like it's bigger. You get iPhone. Bye. <laughs> Off we go. All right, so we have our roast here. It's got all of the stuff. <laughs> got our crock pot. Let's turn it to high. Pour it in. Good job. Sprinkle. Get them all. Good job. Dump in the potatoes. Dump in the potatoes, Bowie <laughs> Good job, dude. Look at mommy. High five. Oops. Yep. Good boy. <laughs> Okay, we have Dolly Parton Southern Style Banana Cake. I saw this at the store yesterday and thought, oh my God, gotta try it. We need a cake pan, buddy. Hello, we like you like this. Here, I like this. Okay guys, so we are gonna make the Dolly Parton banana cake mix. Yes, here it is. And Nia's is gonna crack the four eggs. It calls for four eggs, a cup of milk, and a half cup of melted butter. I am going to spray the pan. Crack four eggs in there, sweetie. What good job! He loves to do the eggs, and he's actually pretty good about it. Get another one.
gently, okay? I smell it. Oh, yeah. Let me smell it. Ooh, that's nice. That smells good. Okay. Banana milkshake. Banana milkshake. Banana milkshake. Mmm. Smells good, huh? It smells like bananas. Yeah, like a banana milkshake. Banana milkshake. You're so funny. Okay, you guys, here I am cutting up some onions, celery, and potatoes for homemade potato soup. Uh, the main ingredient in this soup is sour cream. That is honestly what makes the soup so good. I don't know if you guys have ever made a potato soup like this, but this is my favorite. My grandmother actually used to make this soup all the time. I remember when we were kids, we would go to her house and we'd always be eating it. So tasty. And of course, mine never tastes like hers, but it is what it is. For some reason, my older sister has her recipe perfected, but one day I'll get it. But Right now, it is so good, and I enjoy it. I sent my daughter a little video of the soup cooking, and she was laughing, telling me, what a tease I am because she's at school with all the nasty food. All right, this little baby just woke up. She yeah. wants to look around and see look, what Kito and I are doing. Want to show the camera what we have? Look, show everybody. Look at A cherry Pepsi. Pepsi. <laughs> we are going to have a cauliflower cheese pizza for lunch. They're really good. They're the ones from Aldi's. Um, I don't know, they're just so tasty. So that's what we're gonna have, a cauliflower cheese pizza, just to hold us over till all our other goodies are done. Our roast has been going for a while now. Um, let's see what time is it. The roast has been going for about an hour and 20 minutes now. Our banana cake is out of the oven. Potato soup is halfway done. And then we are gonna do some apple chips and also some homemade sugar cookies. And I was thinking we would dye them like fun Halloween colors. But yeah, little Joe, she wants to get in on the action. She's like, mama, the kitchen is smelling so good. What is all that? She's like, I can't just sleep when everything smells so good. Yeah, you wanna say hi, Jolene? This Jolene getting so big i'm gonna put her in her bumbo seat so she can look around and yeah i'll be right back guys okay guys here i am mixing up a roux using some of the broth from the soup and some flour i'm now adding some sour cream into a measuring cup where i am going to mix the roux in with the sour cream and gently add it to the soup this helps so the soup doesn't become grainy and the sour cream melts in nicely would you look at that such tasty creamy potato soup you guys this is literally my favorite soup to make okay i have a duncan heinz cream cheese icing I uh, warmed it up in the microwave on about 30 seconds, and now I am pouring it over the cake. Anytime I buy store-bought icings, I always do that. Homemade is so much better, but today we just had so many projects going. I went with a pre-made frosting, which ended up being really good.
I had some leftover chocolate chips from my cupboard, so I decided to sprinkle them all over the top of the cake, and I think it just made a nice little touch, and it definitely tasted so, so good, you guys. Mama busy, like I said, I think it's because she smells all the sweet treats, or should I say sweet and savory. This cake looks amazing, you guys. Oh my goodness, I put cream cheese icing on it, and then I had some leftover chocolate chips, so I just finished the bag off, threw them all on top of the cake, and I think this is gonna be delicious, like warmed up a little bit with a cup of coffee. And the chocolate chips will just be a little bit soft so it's gonna go perfect I can't wait to try it um, yeah I'm gonna gain a lot of weight with this fall weather aren't I but that's okay I wouldn't have it any other way I gotta stay cushiony for my little Jolene <laughs> but yeah so and Nia's he's just been back and forth between watching cartoons and helping me out and then Millie she is um, you know just had the baby so Right now, she got out. I think she just used the bathroom, but it's pouring out, so I don't know. She hasn't went out yet, so I have to monitor, make sure she doesn't go have an accident somewhere. But yeah, we will see. I'll show you guys the puppies here soon. They are so precious. Here I am cutting up some apples and making apple chips. I'm slicing them as thin as I can get them because to me, they come out much crispier and crunchier and I just like them like that. I sprinkled them with some McCormick cinnamon sugar seasoning. This stuff is awesome. There's little Nia's watching his iPad. Sup, bro? <laughs> And here's little Jolini, Tortellini, waiting for her diaper change. <gasps> Let's see that chubby little bubby. Let's see that chubby little belly. Yeah. Yeah, let's see it, Mama. Oh, look at that sweet smile. <gasps> okay, I'm looking. Oh, see that belly. Look at that little belly belly. Let's check it out. Let's check it out, girl. What we got going on? <gasps> Ooh, what we got going on? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, look at these thighs. Oh, they're getting so juicy. Ma. They're getting so juicy. Ma, Ma. <laughs> look at Ma. Look at Look at those hands. Cool. I almost see them. Almost yeah? see them. Do you? You want to go see those kids? Uh -huh. You want to be their friend? Uh -huh. I get He wants to make friends with everybody, uh -huh. doesn't he? Yes, uh -huh. he does. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I want to see my bro. Yeah? You want that to be your bro? Ma, those are my bro. Are they? Uh -huh. Those are my sons. Your sons? That's my bro. That's your aunt. You're so funny. I miss them. Mom, I miss them. Do you? Uh -huh. You miss them? Uh -huh. Hmm. Buto has some brothers that we don't kind of know about, I guess. <gasps> Abu! And she's just fascinated and captivated. Hi, Jolene. <gasps> Abu! A goo goo goo. A goo goo. You got a lot to say, don't you, Mama? Yes, you do. Stretch them little. Look at these little tooties. Oh, they're such pretty little tooties. Them little tooties. They're so cute, baby. Yes, they are, Joe. Yeah. 
A goo goo. Hi. You talking? <laughs> Oh. Say it, Mama. Tell it. Tell me all about it. <laughs> You're so cute. I love you. <laughs> All right, let's get this diaper change on the road. I love the sound and the smell of the rain. Oh my goodness, it is just so therapeutic. I just, I don't know what other word to use but that to explain it. goodness I am burning out from all the cooking I've been doing so I'm standing outside for a minute and it feels so good I love rainy days getting a little bit of a shower so I probably should get back inside but guys this feels amazing just been like keeping the door open periodically just so I can listen to the sound of the rain and also it's kind of keeping it so it's not so hot in here since I've been cooking so much all day um, yeah I have a towel there on the floor just to make sure no water comes in yeah and that's about it I love rainy days I do it's so nice do you guys like rainy days? Comment down below and let me know. We did not get to the cookies today because I had to take my daughter to gymnastics, but we did make a lot of goodies and we enjoyed our time together, which is what matters most. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and also have a great day. Bye.